frontier. A frontier represents uncharted territory. It could be a remote piece of land or a new field of study, but if someone calls it the frontier, you are challenged to explore it. Alaska, the last frontier. At least that's what everybody says. Well, I got to experience it firsthand. And by firsthand, I don't mean a postcard or a cruise ship. I mean that I spent a week in Yakutat, Alaska, going after some of the biggest fish in one of the smallest boats. There were ups and there were downs. There were the highest of highs and the lowest of lows. Alaska isn't all everyone thinks it is. This place that just has a bunch of mountains and not many people live there. The people here are like no other place. I came in expecting people not to like us because we are tourists, but they embraced us and I never had anyone look down upon us. Alaska can be tough. It rains over 200 inches in Yakutat every year, so a sunny day is a miracle. You can't really experience the harshness of Alaska until you spent 10 hours in a boat in rainy, cold, and windy conditions with no way out but the bottom of the river. There's a certain reality to when you realize there is no other way to shelter. I came to Alaska and went fishing on the ocean for two days, and as like most days here, it was foggy and cloudy. Then our final day here, there wasn't a cloud in the sky. The mountains came out of nowhere. These huge peaks off in the distance left us in bewilderment. There are people that have been on this trip with us years before and never even knew mountains were there. Alaska is a harsh place, but it can also be majestic. When they say the last frontier, they mean it. Alaska is amazing and will always hold a special place in my heart.